Hey viewers, well, welcome back to another Sword Guy 324 video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a on and off fountain. These are all the fountains I made, uh, one by one, memorizing how to build them, until finally I built um, this fountain, and I memorized how to do it. This is an on and off switch fountain that you can put in like, in like, a plaza or something. It looks pretty cool, pretty neat. Uh, I made it myself. All these things that I show you, I made me myself, so. Okay, so you start off with the corners, so you make one block, then you go one, two, three, and there's another block, so there's three space, there's a three block space in between these blocks. One, two, three, and you just make that all around. One, two, three. Then get your, whoops, I didn't have it. Get a uh, slab. I have, I have a slab. You can get pretty much whatever you want, but I, some type of slab. Slab. And you want one sticky piston to do this. Anyway, so you put down your three slabs like so. And now in the middle here break a block and put a sticky piston in there and put two slabs on top of it. So far you should look like this. And it, you, you need a button or a switch. Either one will work. If you... This is how to make the um, piston activate. Put the switch right here. The button, that is. And dig two blocks on the side of the button and one block under like that so right now we're under the button or th this redstone's under the button so get the redstone under the button make your way to the uh, piston right here so we're gonna connect the piston to the button now you can't do it like this you can't put a block and then redstone connecting right to the piston that would be a fail. I'll show you why in a second. So just do that. Okay, hold it. It's lagging. I can't get up. Ah! I'm just going to get myself up like this. Sorry for the lag. Okay, cover the surface and then cover these blocks. So now it'll activate the piston. So now what you want to do is go here we go. Go one, two, three, four, five. Five slabs up. One, two, three, whoops. Four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And again, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so now the uh, next thing you have to do is build uh, slab blocks connecting it. Like this. See? This is one this is one that was a mistake. This is one uh these two slab blocks. I call them slab blocks because it, it makes a block out of slabs. So make make a line of slab blocks connecting each uh, each corner. So now it should look like this. We're almost there. Cover the top now don't go don't do the bottom half. Don't do this. Do the top half. The reason why my computer's lagging so bad is because I'm using a, a recording software as I'm playing Minecraft and that lags the game up a bit. It's really bad right now. I don't know why. Uh, okay. So now you I'm gonna minimize. I have it on short. I want to get the best quality. Okay, so I mean not the best quality. I want to not lag. Okay, so anyway. So now you should look like this after covering the top. You should look something like this. So now what you want to do is cover the rest. It should look something like this, and the black might be there. So back at the top, uh, 
Why can't I fly? Something's wrong with. I, I seriously can't fly. This is, okay, finally. So, in the middle, right here, this is where the water block is going to be. So, you want to cut down the middle block, the slot block, and put on the top half. Okay, so you see what I did there? It used to be like this. It used to be like this. You break those two and put on the top half. Put the slab on the top half. I'm not even going to try that anymore. Okay, so, now the final thing you have to do is get your water bucket. Which I should have had in the first place. Sorry. Um, right there. And then you want to cover the slab because it's going to go everywhere. <coughs> oh yeah, I forgot to do You just have to cover these corners up like this. That was a mistake. Cover the corners. And the button got washed off from the water. And right there. So the reason why... Oops. There we go. So the reason why we, uh... Oh. Well, one last thing. You want to cover any black spots that remain. Like so. Cover all the black spots. Like so. There we go. So that's the final uh, piece. That's the final thing. Make sure you get the corners. So the reason why we didn't want to connect the um, redstone directly to the piston is because we're going to have to get rid of that block that the water's hitting. And that means the water would come washing all the redstone away. And we don't want that. So that's the on and off fountain. Uh, there's a few mistakes that I made throughout. I'm sorry. Um, like the flying lag. I can't fly. And the four corners. You want to make sure you get the slabs there. So, uh, anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching my video. I'll show you what the first one looked like. This was the first one I made. I know. I thought it looked cool or something. Very first one I made. And I thought I kind of wanted to get rid of that, th the top. I wanted to make it flat, so this is what I came up with here. And the reason why there's so many fountains is I told you before I practiced a lot to, to get it in my head so I know how to do it. Anyway, thanks for watching, and as always, subscribe, and I guess I'll just see you next time.